In this exciting episode of The Voyage Home, we take on the pirates of LHS-3315 with the goal of impressing the brass of the Federal Navy, getting one step closer to the rank of Petty Officer and a flyby of Earth. Hello everybody and welcome back to Elite Dangerous. So as you can see, we have a new ship. We are sporting a beautiful eagle. So I upgraded to this so that we could do some more effective combat. Uh, it is a beautiful looking little ship. I even gone with my, uh, I, I go with like a black and red color scheme, but the white on there is pretty nice too. And, uh, but yeah, so Anubis colors. <laughs> I think it looks pretty fancy. I hope you guys do too. Let's take a look at what this thing is outfitted with. All right, so we've got ourselves on the top a uh, multi-cannon, and on the bottom we have two pulse lasers. These have been working out really nice. So I've got the pulse lasers for taking down the shields and then also doing extra hull damage, and the multi-cannon for then taking down the hull at a much faster rate. And testing this out in um, some uh, resource extraction sites has proven to be extremely good. Uh, the kill worm scanner, of course, for getting higher bounties on the things we do kill. But I've also managed to be able to A-rate this ship completely. So we've got the military-grade composite. Uh, we've got our best power, possible power plant, best possible thrusters, uh, best possible th frame shift drive. Uh, good life support, but keeps the, the D-level keeps the weight low, so we have a better jump range. Uh, power distributor, best possible. Uh, best possible sensors. Uh, best possible fuel tank for this. That's just all you can get. Uh, and uh, best possible shield generator. Then what you'll see down here is we have a frame shift drive interdictor. And also I put in two hull reinforcement packages right here uh, to tank out our hull a little bit, make us harder to kill. Then what you'll see is combat. Oh, wait, hey, we we now have combat novice. We've, up, we've, uh, we've gotten better. Um, I believe mostly aimless and mostly penniless is still our, our ranks for explore and trade. And then I got the wonderful paint job here. But uh, but yeah, there's there's our baby. She looks pretty good. And it's an effective combat ship, I will say. And it's fast and agile. It's crazy awesome. So that's the uh, the ship upgrade that we have. Currently, if you guys are interested, we are in the LTT7069 uh, system. And this is actually a decent place to go for uh, bounty hunting in a ring system so if you're interested and you're looking for one it has if we look at the details common reserves and it has a rocky ring which is good this interior one this is the one where the resource extraction sites are there was only a low one here when i was here last time but when i went in there uh there was tons of excellent ships to shoot at uh and uh made been, made a good amount of cash there so there you go there's a tip also you'll see on the map here is there a like on here that is our old Sidewinder. It is at the same starport. This is where we bought the uh, Eagle as well. But it's sitting here. This is the first ship I have that's actually in, like, stored in a shipyard. So you can see here now I actually have stored ship. There it is. There's our beautiful little Sidewinder. Now, I totally uh, sold everything off of it before I bought my new ship. You can trade them in and make the money, but I kind of want to keep all of our ships, you know? have them littered around the solar system and then be able to come back to them whenever we want. If we get, you know, nostalgic and we want to go around and fly in our sidey. But anyhow, there it is. All right. So now we're in the bulletin board and uh, I just wanted to kind of go over some of the mission stuff that I learned over the last week. Um, first and foremost, these, these uh, help to repair our station. Charity begins like these ones here, these aid are just amazing for increasing your rank. So like right now, we are at 30% uh, in the recruit rank. So if I do this charity mission, you'll see here effect on reputation is high. I can accept that. And then once we've accepted it, now we can actually make our donation. And we do good things. And if you look over here now, we're at 30, 38%, right? And our friendliness is at 62. So that worked out quite well. So I'm going to do this one as well. It's also high on, on reputation. And then turn it in. And now 43% recruit rank. All right, so uh, the next thing that I've learned is 
the best missions to do to increase your rank, and missions are actually one of the best ways to increase your rank, uh, is to do combat-oriented missions. So you'll see down here, this one here is a contract assassination. Um, it's not for the Federation though, right? So you have to look for this little icon over here. This contract assassination doesn't have one, and it's also unattainable. But if it wasn't, and it had, <laughs> if it had two things that it doesn't, it'd be good. Um, but this one here, proactive combat missions available. Uh, so like this one here is a classified transportation. You'll see rep effect on reputation is medium. So it's better than some of the low ones. I think like the trade ones and things are lower. But if we go to this one here, proactive combat missions available. This one here is target pirate. And we have to kill 19. Wow. But its effect on reputation is high, right? Um, and we have one day and four hours to finish this. So I'm going to accept this mission. And we're going to go take on a bunch of pirates. But we need to go to space in LHS 3315. All right, so we are in the system we need to be in. And what does it say we have to do here? A little gunboat diplomacy. So I'm assuming we just have to fly around here looking for pirates. Let's see, I'm assuming if they're wanted, then they're a pirate. Wanted. Mission target. There you go. So, ooh, okay, we need to... I don't know if we can take a Diamondback Explorer, but we'll try. Oh, uh, okay, so he jumped out, and let's go get him. Let's see if we can do this. So my loadout is uh, overpowered. Like, I have t too much stuff for my power, so you'll see when I, when I drop out, when I turn on my uh, weapons and everything, there's going to be a power warning, but that's all fine. Because stuff will turn off, but uh, the stuff we need will stay on. Warning, temperature critical. Oh, God, okay. He was like at the sun there. What the hell? Warning, taking heat damage. Wow. <laughs> Let's get away from the sun. Warning, taking heat damage. Yeah, I see that. Come on, cool down. Wow. Okay, so that guy um, evaded us by just flying into the sun, it looks like. Wanted mission target. Okay. So we want to get in behind this guy. And then interdict. He was coming towards us. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, I think he's trying to get in behind us, too. <laughs> get behind target, yeah. Are you trying to... Maybe we just let him get behind us. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> you can have us. We want you. Stay on them. I'm gonna scan them. And let's see if we can do this. Max weapons. Diverting power to weapons. Target shields offline. Time for you to go down. Oop. Oh, I should be targeting this power plant actually. I wish there was a way to do that by voice. I really hope they add that API, API in the future. Come on. Target shields online. Take 
found those shields. So I've noticed that these pulse lasers are just not firing constantly, and I've got full weapon power. So something's wrong with them. Why are they not shooting? I don't understand. Target shields offline. There we go. Multi cannon will take take them down though. There we go. We got him. Target destroyed. That's one, right? Go to our transactions. One out of 19. <laughs> All right, so we're going to jump into the nav beacon and see if we can find some mission targets in here. All right, here we go. We found a guy at a nav beacon. So we're going to come in on him. I don't think we have the time to actually... Him, but we're just gonna take him out. There we go. Target destroyed. Now that should Scan be two. Detected. Two. So one thing that I've learned is actually, if you sit around in here, you can just wait for the pirates to show up. They're shooting at people. I was actually just sitting here, and I heard the sound of gunfire. Next thing you know. Three. Found one. There we go. I'm gonna get a scan in on this one. Hi, Jasmine. Deer stalker. You have stalked your last deer. Target shields offline. Hit him. Got a pretty beefy hull on this guy. Target shields online. Target shields offline. Boom. Can't wait to get our shields back up. We almost got taken out there. Target destroyed. All right, so. Four. Ooh, we got a python. A wanted python up here. We're gonna go in and scan this guy. The feds will come and help us. He's all by him, just lonesome. And I think we're ready to engage. Python, don't get in my way, Mr. Eagle. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> Target destroyed. Bye. Oh god, we got a little wanted sidewinder. You're mine. Destroyed. Counts as a kill. Number six. Look at all the wreckage just floating off through space there. You see that piece going there, all those pieces flying off. I think that's the sidewinder that we just destroyed. We got an anaconda on the radar. We got a wing of two. Diamondback scout. I think that's his buddy. Yeah, that's his buddy there. Let's go scan him too. Don't want to lose that anaconda though. What's he doing? Okay, his shields are still up. 
So he's at 95. Okay, let's go after this guy. He's going down faster. This will make us unfriendly with the anaconda as well. But if we can get rid of him fast. Come on, baby. Target shields online. Target shields offline. Okay, that one's done. Anaconda. Where are you? You're next. Okay. Get on his tail. Stay on his tail. Help out. Yeah, he might. I hope he doesn't. No shields before you die. Really want to know what's up with my lasers. If you guys have any idea why my lasers aren't shooting. I don't have any idea. Target shields online. Now, now they're going. And now they're not. And they're full power. And they're not overheating. It has to be something to do with the power. Target shields offline. You have to do some research on this. He rams me. There we go. 210,000. Woo! Woo! Eight. We're making good money on this, too. Lots of bounties. Okay, he's wanted, but he's not a pirate. He's not a mission target. Might as well get the bounty on him while we're here, huh? Target shields offline. Scan detected. There we go. Time to die. Not a Target lot of bounty, destroyed. but did help us get up to nine. Look at this. Tobacco. Somebody dropped their load of tobacco and bio waste. <laughs> oh, I'm out of ammo. Okay, this will be the last guy, and then we'll have to... Head on out. Because all we got left of these stinking lasers that don't want to work. I don't know why. I'm pulling the trigger right now. There we go. Target destroyed. All right. Scan detected. Ten. We got ten. So this is a Federation run system. All right. So turning in uh, bounty vouchers here should also help with our rank. Let's redeem all of these. Alright, so I've decided to come over to this ring gas giant instead and see if we can go into this. So there's a resource extraction site here, a hazardous one. I don't think I've ever been into one of these before, but I'm hoping there's pirates in here. Hello miners, we're here to save you! Now, hazardous, does that mean that the feds, like the Federal Security Service might not show up here? Yeah, so he is wanted. So I don't know if we're all on our lonesome here. But if he gets distracted by shooting at other things, although this federal gunship is uh, pretty tanky if I remember correctly. Let's see if we can do this. See if this is too hazardous for us. 
multi cannons out of ammo. Oh, that place didn't have reloading. Okay. I guess we're making another trip. I didn't even notice that. Let's see if we can do this guy with the lasers. That don't work! Okay, I'm curious now. If I go over to modules, and since our multi cannon isn't build anyway. Let's deactivate it. See if that helps with the power draw. Because we're not helping this guy out much with these lasers. Yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah, see he's coming after us now. Two, one, engage. Yeah, so I think hazardous means there's no feds. <laughs> Warning. Temperature critical. No, it's not. Go here. Hopefully they have the ability to rearm us. Refuel. Nope. Repair refuel. Where can we go to rearm? Well, this system stinks. We have to leave the system to rearm? Alright, here we are back in the right place to be looking for pirates. Basically. We're gonna take a look around here. So I did, while I was off getting refueled and reloaded, I did a little bit of looking around about my gun problem, or my laser issue. Now, what some people are saying on the forums is that the Eagle, actually, the placement of the um, hard points on the bottom of the, uh, of the ship there, and that's where I've got my lasers, is sometimes the ship itself can get in the way of them. So, it's interesting. So, uh, we'll see if maybe trying to line up our shots. Like, if you have it too high up on the HUD, they say, then it's out of, uh, out of the firing arc for this ship. So, I'll keep an eye on that. And I'll keep an eye, too, on the reticle and everything and see if, if it actually notices anything different. But that's interesting. So, we got to be more careful about how we line our ship up, it looks like. Seems like a bad design. <laughs> All right, so let's try out on this guy. He's just wanted, but uh, so my weapons are firing. So we're firing just fine. We got to keep him on the bottom half of our screen. Oh, max weapons. All right, I think that is actually the case. So yeah, the hull of the ship is actually blocking the lasers. There we go. Well, now I know. So now I can actually effectively use my lasers. A boom, and he was worth quite a bit too. Eleven. Target shields offline. Twelve. Target shields online. Target shields offline. All right, I'm getting better at these. Keeping the uh, enemy at the right spot to use my lasers. Good. Thirteen. Perfect. 14. Cool. Alright. Another one. Destroyed. 15. Woohoo! Oh my god. We need to be behind him. Oh, come on. Shields offline. Crap. Integrity compromised. Take Max damage. engines. Max engines. Power to engines. Whoa. Okay, yeah, we should have waited on that guy a bit. I'm glad we didn't take him on our own. Holy. Okay, he's engaged with somebody else now. Whew. Okay, let's, let's stay back a bit and wait for our shields to come up. See if we can stay on him this time. Oh, crying out loud. Whoa. 
Whoa. Where's that other guy? Did I take out the other guy? I think we might need to run. Retract weapons. Shields offline. Taking damage. Stirring weapons. Yep. We took out that other guy. Are we gonna die here? Please don't let us die here. Oh god. Canopy compromised. Engage super cruise. Engaging cruise. We're gonna die. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god. Two, one, engage. Oof. Warning, temperature critical. Oh my goodness. Let's get out of there. Oh, okay, we need to. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I am a little bit nerve wracked on that one. Took off a little bit more than we could chew there. Wow, <laughs> that was a close one. We have 13%. Four, oh. three, two, one, engage. Oh my goodness. Okay, we made it back to Cellar's Gateway with our life. <laughs> so we will get some refueling and we will have all of those repairs and all of that reloading. <laughs> wow, okay, now while we're here, let's uh, let's turn in these bonds as well. Alright, so, here we are once again. Who do we have on the docket? Okay, oh, and he's in a wing of two. Who else is here? He's in a wing of two clippers, or couriers. Oh, wow. No, a clipper and a courier. Okay, okay we're getting in on this one. Ah. Under attack. Yeah, I know. Right. Come on, jeez. Oh shoot. Retract weapons. Retracting all weapons. I did it. I could be able to finish this mission. Engage super cruise. Engaging super cruise. Wanted here now. Ah. Four. That's what happens when you accidentally two, shoot his one, <laughs> federal security. Engage. Okay. Freak out over. It looks like uh, my bounty and my fine is fairly short. <laughs> it's a $400 credit bounty in this system, but it'll expire in four minutes, according to this. I think it must have been a little bit longer than that when I landed, but I just have to wait this out and then I can go back. <laughs> okay, so quick update on this. It looks like uh, I actually have to jump out and jump back into the system. It says on H jump. So I'm going to assume that's what that means. Uh, so yeah, I'll give that a go and see what happens. Okay, we're jumping back. Let's see if we're still wanted. Four, three, crossed. two, one, engage. Oh, okay, everything looks fine. Everything's fine, nothing to worry about. <laughs> Kaboom, and here we are. Be nice, you know, just give us a couple of sideies. Just finish this up with something simple. <laughs> Scan detected. We'll see what goes down here. Whoa. Whoa. That was close. That was frightening. I nearly jumped out of my seat. Target shields are flying. Boom. Target okay. destroyed. We got him. We needed a success quick there. 
16. Scan detected. Target shields offline. All right, boom. Got him. Target destroyed. Whew. 17. Ooh, that was a good hit. Okay, 18 of 19. Yes, it is, and it's a wing of two, though. Who else is in the wing? An eagle. Now the question is, is, is that anaconda gonna engage on me if I take out this wing? Probably, huh? Oh, crap! I thought I had my k scanner. Is he mean to me now? Yes, he is. Oops not what I wanted to do. Let's stay away from that. Wow, that's not going to be good. Where's that eagle? Okay, we got him. And our mission is updated. Okay, so we could take off if we wanted to now. So we'll wait and see what happens with this anaconda. Because I kind of want him to. How many people are shooting at him? Just the one? Yeah, I think it is. I think we just got the one guy. He's gonna be a goner. Retracting weapons. We'll keep an eye on this. If that guy goes down and there's nobody else engaged in on him, we're gonna get out of here. Because he will come after us. Once that guy, oh no. I think he's doomed. And if nobody else engages, and I don't think people are going to engage. That guy's on a- yeah, okay, let's get out of here. Engage Super Cruise. Preparing for cruise. Yep, he's gone. Yeah, he's coming after us. Get away. Oh. Four, three, two, one, engage. <laughs> Whew. We made it out. Warning, temperature critical. Ooh, that was close, huh? Here we are at within Jean Station or hangar. I'm sure I said that wrong. Oop, nope. First thing we do is refuel and repair. And here is our transaction, so we're going to be turning in those guys here. Alright, so legal fines. All fines combined. Yeah, okay, we'll pay that. That was our bad, we shot him. And then, uh, redeem the Federation and the LHS. Oh, we can redeem the Alliance stuff here too. Oh, for this station, okay, cool. And we're in a Federation system, might as well just do it all here. So we just have the M wow, 166,000 credits in the bount in uh, bounty in the Empire. So I'll have to go off to an Empire system again. Did that once in the past. So now this mission is updated. We need to go to yeah. Okay, so we got to go back to the station we got the mission from right here. So there was a nice little marker on there for us. So we'll plot our route to that. Head on back here and turn in this mission and see how it does for our, for our rank. Gear down. All right, here we are. So let's take a look. We are at 85% allied and we are at 43% recruit. Confirm. Confirmed. 43, so yeah, so we went up quite a bit in recruit rank. And we are 15% combat novice. 
that's pretty good. Yeah, we're not doing too shabby here. So we finished that mission off with a, a bump in a recruitment rank. We've got 2.7, almost 2.8 million credits because of all of the uh, bounty hunting that we were turning in. Um, so, I mean, obviously it was a long, uh, that pirate on pirate action was a very long mission. And uh, you probably could have done a lot, maybe more missions in between uh, that would have got you more rank. So this might not be the greatest way to rank up like really fast, but if you want to rank up and make some cash while you're at it, right? You're turning in all those bounty ventures as well. So it's pretty cool for, for that. And it was a lot of fun. Like I enjoyed running out there and uh, kicking a bunch of ass and getting my ass kind of handed to me a couple of times too. <laughs> um, it was all in good fun though, right? So with that, we're one step closer to that cadet rank with midshipman and petty officer left. Once we've achieved petty officer, we'll be able to make our voyage home and take a beautiful flyby of the planet Earth. So I hope you enjoyed that awesome pirate on pirate action i had a lot of fun i hope you had a lot of fun and if you did feel free to use that like button it really does help out my channel quite a bit if you're new to my channel and want to know when i release new videos hit that subscribe button i release new episodes of elite dangerous on wednesdays as well as live streams of elite dangerous on thursdays and mondays and if you like space games you might also be interested in my space engineers videos i hope you enjoyed thank you for watching have an absolute great one and i'll see you next time